Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're just stopping by for the first time. Um, today I'm going to be doing week number two update in my mini happy planner. Um, this is week two of my weight loss journey and I transferred everything into this brand new planner that I just got at Michael's. This is the mini happy planner, the squad goals one, and I absolutely love it. And I transferred April, May, and June. I took off the mini discs that come on this, on the Mini Happy Planner. These are the classic size discs. And I just put those, switched everything over to the classic size discs. And now I have a whole lot more room in my planner. So let's get in here and this is a little bookmark that I made. Let me zoom you in a little bit here. Last week I was down six pounds. So I was pretty excited about that. I don't expect that much this week. So let's get into it. Um, the 23rd, here's what I had for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Uh, right after work, I did go to Monument Park and I walked the Monument Steps. Um, it's 96 steps up, 96 steps down. I did that twice and I got in 10,332 steps. Tuesday, breakfast bar, soup and sandwich, salad. Got 6,554 steps in. Wednesday was date night. So I fell off the wagon a little bit. I did really good for breakfast and lunch. Had oatmeal and salad. Um, so then for dinner, for date night, we went out to this nice little pub near us. And they had uh, wings on special. I got six garlic wings. I did not order fries of my own, but I counted. I had ten fries off of my husband's platter. And I got a light beer. I got in 7,482 steps that day. Thursday was the 26th. It would have been my dad's 97th birthday. Um, I did really good for breakfast and lunch. I uh, had cereal, baked potato, and salad for lunch. Um, funny story, I was off and we had to go pick up my granddaughter uh, after school. And they live about probably 30 to 35 minutes away from us. So my husband was going to go by himself. And I said, you know, you better let me go with you. Um, he'd never been to the school before. And I said, they're kind of funny about, you know, who picks, you know, the kids up. And you, uh, I don't think you're on the roster. So you better let me go with you. Thank goodness I did. Because as we were getting off the exit of the interstate, my husband ran over something and we ended up with a flat tire. Luckily, we were, on, we were between half a mile and three quarters of a mile um, from picking her up. It was five minutes before the time, the, the last pickup time. So my husband stayed with the car, took everything out of the trunk, started changing, putting the donut on, and I was trucking it to go pick my granddaughter up. I get there and she goes, Nana, she goes, did you walk? <laughs> I said, yes, I did. And guess what? You get to walk with me back to the car. <laughs> so, so that was my Thursday. That was my day off. I'm surprised I only got 9,567 steps in because I, I felt like I walked forever. So the 27th was Friday. Um, had a breakfast bar, um, a taco bowl from Taco Bell, and had a salad. I got 6,782 steps in. Saturday, uh, we went out for breakfast. I had an omelet for breakfast. For lunch, um, I did sausage, uh, green peppers, potatoes in the crock pot. It was really good. I just had a small bowl of that for lunch, and then for dinner I had a salad. I got 7,442 steps in. Today is Sunday. Um, 
It's about two o'clock in the afternoon. I had cereal for breakfast. I had a smoothie for lunch. And for dinner, I am doing um, roasted vegetables in the oven. So I'm going to have that. And I think my husband is picking up a rotisserie chicken. So that's probably what I'm going to have for dinner. I did really, really good drinking my water. I did not get 10,000 steps in every day. Um, I try to do my best to get 10,000 steps in, but sometimes I just can't. Um, this week I failed miserably. I only did it one time. I got really close on Thursday, but really only surpassed 10,000 steps on Monday the 23rd. All right, guys. Here is the drum roll, please. Usually I weigh myself on Saturday. Um, I waited because I didn't get to film this yesterday, so I figured I'd wait till today. I am only down 1.2 pounds. So I'm a little upset. But I guess some loss is better than none. I'm trying to look at this positively. I know that everybody loses at a different rate. Um, I guess I'm just kind of disappointed because I really did not eat that badly and I only lost 1.2 pounds. Um, my husband, you know, was trying to be encouraging. He goes, you know, he goes, you still lost. You know, he goes, count that as a success. You still lost. And what I think I'm going to do is um, have him, I'm going to give him the tape measure and uh, let him do my measurements. When I was on the Formu 3 diet, um, they took measurements. Um, let me zoom you back out here. They took our measurements from our neck, from um, our arms, our waist, our chest, the top of our thighs, and around the ankles. And I think I am going to do that. That way, just in case I don't lose any pounds, but I lose inches, I will at least feel like I was successful. Because the worst thing we can do is start beating ourselves up and get defeated. I mean, this is only week two. And I know they say that between a one and a two pound weight loss is probably very healthy and very sensible. I'm just not a patient person. I, I admit it, it is one of my many flaws and I hate it about myself, but I'm just gonna have to try to do better. I'm gonna pray about it and ask for the Lord to help me because your girl is very impatient. So I am very happy that I did lose. Um, I'm very happy that I didn't gain, but I guess I just expected maybe a little bit more. And I know that first week, a lot of it was, wa was um, water loss. It wasn't actual fat that I lost. So trying not to beat myself up. I'm trying to put this down as a success. So, um, all right guys, that is it for this week. I hope you enjoyed this week two of my weight loss journey. Um, stay tuned for next week and hopefully we will have another weight loss. All right, guys, I will talk to you soon. Um, be sure to hit that thumbs up button if you like this video. Um, don't forget to comment and please subscribe if you have not done so already. I would love to have you part be part of my YouTube family. I think the last time I checked, I think I was up to 730 subscribers. So I'm inching my way up to that thousand subscriber mark and I couldn't be happier. I would love it if you would share my um, videos on your social media and, you know, if you like the content of this video or any of my other videos, please share it. I would really appreciate it. 
All right, guys, that's it for today. I will see you in my next video. Until then, God bless. Bye-bye.